Hey everyone, Mark Aquino here. Real quick, uh, I just got done filming my review of the original Spongebob movie from 2004 and I just filmed some scenes that I'm going to put in for my review for the next Spongebob film that will be out very soon. Spongebob 2, Sponge Out of Water. Those two reviews will be out by the end of this weekend. And basically, I wanted to bring up something that I just found out pretty recently. Um, I found out that I just passed 100 subscribers. Yeah, it's... Not gonna lie, it's a, I, I didn't really expect that. Um, I remember when I first started, I just didn't really know whether or not people would really, like, watch my stuff. Um, especially considering how I started out. Um, in fact, I wanted to kind of briefly recap what made me get into uh, making videos in the first place. Uh, well, first of all, it was the fact that Sony rebooted Spider-Man and I was really pissed about it. I'm like, oh, Spider-Man, you ruined my childhood, Sony. The worst idea ever. Oh. oh, sorry. It's doing a, a ton of my voice. In fact, that was actually pretty uh, accurate to how I was when I heard about the news and in my first video, TalkBox Part 1, which, please, don't watch that. Please, please don't watch that video. It's really painful to watch. I just watched it a few days ago, and my god. I mean, I could safely say that I've gotten better since then. That was reason one. Reason two, and this was probably the biggest thing that got me into making videos, was I was searching through YouTube um, for videos of people talking about the, the news of the Spider-Man reboot. And the one that really struck me was a video made by Chris Stuckman. Actually, I don't know if that video was on his channel anymore, um, but he basically talked about the fact that there's going to be a reboot of Spider-Man. I don't know if he was very excited about it either, but it was through that video that made me think, you know what, I want to be like that guy. I, I want to talk about movies in the same kind of way that he did. And as indicated from my first video, I, it really... Ugh. It's like my video and his video, it, it, oh god, it, it's like going from watching The Godfather Part 2 to freaking Joe Dirt, you know? It's just like one of these things is absolutely not like the other. And it was from that video that Chris Stuckman posted, like I said, they made me want to do my own videos, and it's just been going on ever since. And it's from making videos that I got to discover all sorts of other different people like Jeremy Johns and Schmoes No and John from the Flick Pick and discover guys like the Nostalgia Critic and the Angry Video Game Nerd, both of which I met, by the way, once in 2013. It was also from making YouTube videos and wanting to be a filmmaker that I got to participate in Main Stages film program and met all the awesome people there like Michael Lecision and Joe Patino and Diana Lesenby and Jill Lees and Drew Poole. All those great people. So I guess when it all comes down to it, without Chris Stuckman, I wouldn't be here. So it's like, it, he was like, it's like the domino effect. It's like that, seeing that video that he made really set off a whole chain of events for me that made me make YouTube videos and just continue on to this day so and I I sincerely doubt that he's watching this but if you are Chris I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart without you I wouldn't be here right now I wouldn't be making YouTube videos I wouldn't have a hundred and seventy videos right now it all started just from watching you so yeah Thanks. And I'm sure there are plenty of people like, oh, it's his fault. Let's go, you know, hit him on Twitter. It's your fault. He made videos. Damn you. You're Hitler reincarnate. Please don't do that, by the way. <laughs> Please don't, you know, blame him for for this, you know. He's, he's merely the messenger in this whole situation. But yeah, I wanted to thank him. And also thank you to all 100 subscribers that I have. I don't know if every single one of them watches my videos now but if they do that's fantastic thank you thank you so much I, I just again it's just weird to wrap my head around it's like if I could go back in time and tell myself six years ago that 
you would meet all these cool people that all these great things would would sprout from your YouTube channel he wouldn't believe me thank you to all my subscribers for being there thank you to everyone who's been watching my videos even if it's just for like a short period of time or even if it's your first time thanks I really appreciate it and also a huge huge thank you to Chris Stuckman the, the news that Sony rebooted spider-man that was really what got me thinking but it was the Chris Stuckman video that gave me like the push to really get myself out there so thank you Chris Stuckman you can subscribe to his channel in the description down below or you can click right here feel free to follow him on Twitter like him on Facebook as always if you like what you saw here feel free to press that like button share this video with your friends and hey subscribe if you want you might even be subscriber number 101. <laughs> so until next time, I'm Mark Aquino. Thanks for watching, everyone.